everyone and welcome to the beautiful city of Cambridge. My name's Ava Carroll and I'm a second year English student studying at King's College, which is just behind us. So follow me and we can take a look around inside. founded in 1441 by King Henry VI. This college is where I live, so I sleep here, study here, eat here, and of course drink here and have a good relax with friends. the chaos that is the River Cam, we have Bodley's Court accommodation. So this building here is all student accommodation with river views, which is very, very nice. One of my best friends lives on the top floor here, and she's a music student, so has a grand piano in her student room, which is just insane. Although, there is a downside to this accommodation. She has to walk down eight flights of stairs, then go outside to the basement to use a toilet or the bathroom, which you can imagine on a cold, rainy winter night in Britain is not ideal. So here we have the postcard picture of King's College. So you've got the White Gibbs building over there and then King's College Chapel, which took over a hundred years and six kings to build. But it was well worth the wait because this is the second largest chapel in the world and it's been used for all sorts throughout history. So in the English Civil War, Oliver Cromwell actually housed his troops in this chapel here. So if you go in there today, you can see graffiti etched on the walls by the soldiers. And today it's used for all sorts of things, including meditation sessions for students. So students go in, lie on the heated floor of the chapel and stare at the fan vault ceiling for an hour or so. It's very relaxing indeed. Some other members of King's who are having a good relax today are the King's College cows. Yes, we have our own cows here at King's. They're asleep in this field and they're where we get our morning milk from. That's what I tell people on my tours. I'm a punt guide as well. <laughs> some people believe it, some people don't. Um, but I did hear a punter once say that every King's College student who graduates gets a cow to keep. Um, I'll leave it to my mum to figure out where to put a cow at home in Liverpool. Thank you for coming on that whistle stop tour of King's College and make sure that you come and visit one day.